Now introducing Pablo's new mi- Wait, is that a mixtape? It's a project. For wait, what? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay. So, I I got it now. Now introducing Pablo's project for college. Congratulations, by the way. Hello, me amigos. Boy, Pablo coming at you with a presentation that is due for my college class. Now I know this is meant to be a video game video, but. But as you can tell, I had other things to do. Without wasting any more time, let's get this started. Sexy BCU. Okay, my presentation is on the holy grail of reading. By that I mean selecting a read em system. I got about 32 pages of good stuff to put in your squishy brains. So I hope you had your daily dose of milk, because I'm about to explain your beautiful skulls and now. That might be hard to explain, but in due time you'll understand. Take some notes, don't fall asleep, I know I will, but I worked hard on this, so let me put my head down and laugh at the funny parts. Now before you get as good as reading as I did, you gotta get into your soul and wanna read some books. You gotta grab a book and say, I'm gonna learn the hell out of you. This is the first step, developing positive attitudes and behaviors. Next, you gotta know what you wanna learn from your book. You can't get information if you don't know what the information you're trying to get is. It's like interrogating a person without knowing what you're trying to interrogate them for. You just don't do it. Do you want to be entertained? Do you want to have an overview of, on the topic, not looking into the fine details of that work? Do you want to take your time looking over it slowly, every detail, trying to find the true meaning of the Illuminati by being thorough in your reading? Are you trying to get a higher un level of understanding with two or more sources trying to see it? why the hell are they fighting about Something like, can a Magikarp fly, or is it just a really high jump? Magikarp can jump a fucking mountain with splash! That requires enough force to splatter your brains all over the ground with just one move! Now I'm gonna tell you how to gauge a book by its power level! Vegeta, what does a scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! And how knowing his power level will help you in the long run! Now that in a book that is super easy, I want you to read it a page at a time, getting all them good words in your brain at the end of each page! When a book is at its normal level, <laughs> use the read pause approach after every paragraph. Use it to get your brain to not skip any detail of that book. If so, go back and read it. Now, for books that are on the level of Dark Souls and Crash Bandicoot, now I want you to pray to the sun and go on it like it's a mother-loving crusade. Take that book slow. Take in one sentence at a time. This is Latin. You don't know Latin. Slow down and learn some. This is where chunking is involved. You chunk, you are at its core, segregating information into different groups, like I did with this script. It is a real mess to read all of this if it wasn't chunked. And even so, it is still hard. Pun intended. Yes, 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 yes. Surveying the text is next to summon it up. You know how I flashed my script on video? Some of you surveyed it, while others of you weren't looking or stopped to read it fully. If so, you weren't surveying. It just means to skim over the whole book in less than about 30 minutes. Less than about 30 minutes, that sounds pretty good to me. When surveying a piece of writing, think about the title. Mine doesn't really have one. Identify the author. That was pretty easy. Read a, and think about the introduction. What the hell was I thinking in writing this? Read the first paragraph carefully. Well, you know, I'm not, I'm into to the reading and whatnot. Skim the rest of the article and finally read the last paragraph. It's okay. And now we have 22 pages to go. Are you ready, kids? I'm 11, so shut the f- Alrighty then. Now, using a reading system is not easier, nor is it faster, than reading it from start to finish. Because it involves quote-unquote learning, which is a long process that takes years to understand and even more years to do, as shown in some high school students. Not really understanding what is needed to learn, but still passing classes because their teacher is, insert random list of reasons. Pathogens. 
back to reading systems. After skimming the book, you will then question it. Sounds familiar, right? Now the questions you have to ask are called focus questions. They stem from the basic what, why, how, when, which, where. You can ask those questions with the help of the information you just skimmed over. Example, why is this script is in a format that is unreadable to the point where a picture can be flashed from said script and make more sense? But that's too long, so so it's easier to say, why does this script look so bad? Now, the hardest step for anyone is reading carefully. <laughs> I know it's horrible, but it's only because we aren't in our 30s to 40s and understand the importance of books. But it's not the end of the world because you do not have to take notes just to understand the words that are coming out of the book. While not reading at a fast pace, this doesn't mean to do this for the whole book, but only for some parts that wouldn't need notes. Thorough reading takes a lot of time, so get ready to get your feet wet because you're staying in the knowledge pool for a while. As you go dissecting and analyzing what's in the box and what the numbers mean. What's in the fucking box? Hey! Who are you people? What do you want from me? You want the numbers, Mason. That's all we've ever wanted. Now that you've heard all the information I have, it's time for you to go out into the world knowing that I failed you and learn about the reading system. And by me saying that, let's go over everything again. <laughs> Well, that was all I have. Hopefully, you understood something. And if you did, I hope to see you in therapy. Goodbye.